All right, so I think we are live, I believe, and as promised, it's 5.45, and we are live streaming some more customs for LEGO Incredibles, of course. Uh, I am looking forward to going ahead and chatting with you guys. Thank you so very much for the support on the last customs live stream, which was just yesterday, and you guys went ahead and hit over 700 likes on that one, so that is exceptionally awesome. We're going to go on ahead and most likely build two maybe three characters today as well lord logan dude you're just crushing it how are you always first i don't understand what you do man <laughs> you've got like the greatest notification squad ever man you're like always there first it's incredible but nevertheless what's up guys i want to give a quick shout out to a lot of the people who are tuning in as the first few folks of course as i mentioned lord logan 613 michael walks bomb bird crazy gamer game monger maximum likes Cool Caden, Aaron Kenobi, X Gamer 1456XX, Ada World, Rev5, TechSmart7, Gaming with Rainbow Enderman, and Witherzilla and Godzilla. Holy moly, that's a long name, dude. Uh, Airbinder Singh, thank you so very much for tuning in to another live stream. I appreciate that as well. Omarion, the Biscuit Boy, uh, all of you lovely, lovely folks who are tuning in live right now to a brand new customs episode of lego incredibles we're going to be building some customs together here today which hopefully will turn out well we're going to decide on what we build and so on and so forth in just a moment but first and foremost i want to get you guys to of course as always whether or not you're watching the archive version of this or whether you're here live please take a quick moment to go on ahead and as bomber just said in the chat hit that like button that would be very, very highly appreciated. I want to give a special shout out to Lenin or Lenin. I don't know how you say that correctly. Martinez, thank you so very much for being the first person to super chat here today. I do appreciate that as well. And of course, like I always say, the best thing you guys can do costs absolutely nothing is to just simply hit that like button. But if you guys want to go on ahead and support the stream for the more, you are, uh, you can use super chat and, uh, the sponsorship feature sponsors gives you uh, a bunch of new emotes and uh, the super chat feature basically gives you priority in terms of getting your message read. So hopefully that answers everything. Let's get rocking. Let's get rolling. It's customs time. We're going to go on ahead and teleport up here to Edna's or Edna mood place. So we're going to go on ahead and travel there. Uh, Kevin, what's up, man? Thank you for tuning in. Even just for a little bit. I appreciate that a lot. Game monger. I am having a great day. How are you, man? Uh, I hope maybe you tuned into the uh, Fortnite live stream that just uh, ended not that long ago. Thank you for possibly taking the time to do so. I appreciate that. Uh, but how fun is this game? I haven't got it yet because it's not out yet in my country. Oh, is it, is it going to be out in July for you? I think that there's a few countries where it's actually only going to be out in July. So it's going to be a it's going to be a little while before it will be available around the world. Guys, honestly, everyone who's asking me about the um, I don't even know how to say the rapper's name correctly. X X Tan Tantakion Tan Tantakion Tantision. However you say that, I'm sorry. I don't know how to pronounce it. I'm not meaning to offend anyone with that, but I honestly don't know anything about it, so I I can't. I try not to comment on things that I'm completely lost on. So there you go. Hopefully that answers things. So there you go uh i don't even know who that is yeah that that's my point I, I know about it because i saw it all over like twitter and the news but I, I just don't know about like who he is or anything like that so with that in mind ladies and gents i did want to uh, show you guys the hallway here at edna mode's place look at this isn't this cool she's got all these like super suits all around the walls which is your favorite guys um if i had to pick one that red one's pretty cool but then again that's probably because i just like the color red um yeah, I think that red one might be my favorite, actually. That one right there. Kind of Batman-esque, you know, with a circle across the chest there. It looks pretty cool. Legend of Zelda Gamer 88. We already played Fortnite. I streamed it like two hours ago, dude. You should go back, check it out, man. Um, almost got a win as well. Spoiler alert. Uh, just saying you rocked Fortnite. Hey, thanks for saying that, Arbender. I appreciate that, man. Uh, Cypher Duck, what's up, man? All right, guys. We need to determine what we're going to build. We need to decide what characters we're building here today on the second live stream for customs. So what are we guys thinking? What do we want to build? What do we want to build? How do you get the Edna Lego minifigure? Uh, the figure, not the one in the game. Uh, the figure was a pre-order exclusive uh, thing. So, well, actually that's not true because I think there's a junior set that she's in as well. Let me double check actually for you. Lego Junior um, Incredibles. 
to set. Because I'm pretty sure she's in one of them. But again, I don't think it's the same exact figure, obviously. Um, but, 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 uh, is she in any of them? Maybe I'm wrong about that, actually. Wow. Maybe she's not in any of the sets. Huh. I could have sworn she was in one of the sets. They've got Brick. They've got Crusher. But I don't see Edna. So maybe I was wrong about that. Maybe I was wrong about that, but I guess pre-order only was the way to get her. All right, let's see what we've got as far as character choices. So we're going to go on ahead and take a look here. Make yourself. That would be cool. You know what? That's what I'm going to start with, guys. I'm going to start with creating my own design, my own character, uh, like me as though I was a member of the Incredibles uh, world, so to speak. So that's what we're going to go on ahead and do. So first and foremost, uh, we need brown. Oh, actually, we could change colors, of course. I always forget about that. Uh, we need... I have kind of shorter hair now. I don't even know. Let's see. Maybe, 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 maybe that in brown like that. No, that's too long. That is too long, guys. We're going to build myself, and then afterwards, we're going to build two characters. That's going to be up to you guys. So things like... Hey, Renegade Extreme. What's up, man? How's it going, dude? I like that little blitz bot, dude. The little sponsor. You, you see that? You got the one-month badge now, dude. That's really cool. I really like that one. Uh, next one that you're going to get is going to be the one with the sword and shield. So that's going to be really cool, too. Uh, Roy Cube. Hey, what's up? John Wick. Maybe we'll build John Wick. So we'll decide once we get there, okay? So for now, let's go on ahead and begin with this. Maybe I should do actually this one uh, since I'm live streaming, right? It would kind of be fitting, right? Even though the headphones are white, but still. I, I have a pair of black headphones as well, so <laughs> that would work. I think that would be the way we're, we're going to go with it. Why not? Let's do it. All right, so... Probably not going to do any gloves or anything. Well, actually, if you're a hero, you got to have some gloves. No? I don't know. I feel like it would be really impractical to, like, have gloves on all the time. I do want a cape. It would look really cool to have a cape. Uh, even though she always says no capes. I'm going to go with the red cape like that. The red and black. Kind of my favorite colors, though. Well, purple is, too. But that's a pretty good look already. Now, as far as our suit is concerned... We could go with an Incredibles, like, actual suit. But I feel like that would be kind of a cheap choice. The problem is I really like to pick something red, but there really aren't very many options in terms of red costumes. So that sort of stinks. I kind of like that one. I might have to go with blue instead of red for this look. Um, yeah, that might that might be what we have to do. Unless if I find something really cool that's made out of red, but... You know, right now it's not looking like it. Nope. Lumberjack. Lum Lumberjack Blitz. That would be one heck of a look, huh? Hey, Lennon Martinez. Thank you so very much for another super chat. I really, really do appreciate that. Toast. I noticed you in chat as well. Lennon, I guess I'll just give you a shout out. I really wish you would have asked a question or something because I feel bad that you just super chatted. It would be better if you were just like, hey, here's something, you know? You. YouTuber. Kind of? We'll make it work. Kind of. We'll pretend that that's what it means. And that's how you spell YouTuber. With a U instead of a Y. Just pretend. Why not? Why not? Things will work out, I think. I hope. Okay, we're going to need probably purple. Can you even pick purple? Purple hips? Oh, gosh. No, 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 no. I cannot. I cannot go through with this. We cannot have purple leggings. It's going to look ridiculous. I like this. That could work. Maybe even something like that. With a no, I was gonna be like, I'll go with the sneakers. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Not not going with that. That's not going to work. By the way, that would be really great for a Spider-Man uh, design. We could use that for Spidey. Okay, I really like the first one that we picked. That one. So we'll go with the red sneakers. What we'll do is on the. Uh, on this piece, we'll probably go just black on the hips. And then we got to change the torso. I can't, I cannot, I cannot pick that one. What if we did like a business suit? That would be kind of funny. Like the world's weirdest hero. There we go. Right. Let me change actually the arms. There we go. 
<laughs> look at this. This is the world. Hey, dude, sorry for missing the super chat. Uh, Abdul the Boss Vlogs. Thank you so very much for the super chat. I appreciate that. So there we are, guys. That's going to be the look that we're going with. Well, actually, I just realized I can't go with that look because we need to change the face to have a beard. Um. So let's see. What face could we pick? Maybe that? No, I don't have blonde hair. I guess that one kind of works. Civilian Ross. And that might be... Whoa, that's a very, like, angry blitz <laughs> look at this <laughs> uh plus of course my beard is not black so it, it wouldn't really work i'm guessing that one might be the one we go with this would be like uh grandpa blitz right there there we go right um let's see do, 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 do. Uh, i don't think there's any other beards oh that would be epic wait no that one right there no what are you what am i picking that one there that could be a really cool wolverine design should we do that guys that could be really cool. We could build, like, a really cool Wolverine. Hey, actually. That one works, too. The Underminer Goon. Could use that. All right? Could make that work. I don't know. I really like the first one that we picked. I think that works best for this option. Oh, my gosh. Can you imagine if I just had a mustache? We could use this. That would be funny. <laughs> the Super Janitor! Da -da 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 to the rescue. All right, we're going to go with Civilian Ross. There we go, guys. Ready to rock and roll. That's that's that. I don't know what powers I'm going to pick yet. What are we thinking? Fire. Maybe fire would be cool. Now I look like a supervillain. Strength. Why do they all look like supervillains? But that face, it just makes you look evil, doesn't it? Dive. Psionic. Levitate. That look, makes you look kind of like a hero. I guess maybe this one, because it's kind of computer-based, right? So that might be the way to go. We'll pick this one with the computers. There we go. Okay. So we're going to go on ahead and egotistically just enter my name. Save and exit. And that's our first character complete. Lina Martinez, thank you so very much for another super chat. I'm sorry that I didn't miss that one. You got to say something in the message. I feel bad. Stop. Like just big hi or shout out or a question or something. I don't know. All right, guys, time to pick and choose what we're going to go on ahead and build. After this, try to build Poison Ivy. That's an interesting choice. Now, I do know that a lot of people were saying to me, like, Hey, Blitz, you're being a uh, DC fanboy. You only built DC characters because on the last stream yesterday, we only built Batman and Flash. So I was like, you know what? You're right. That's fair. What do you guys want to see from the Spider-Man universe? So I'm going to only pick three characters from the Spider-Man universe, and then we're going to vote for one of those three. Okay. Ooh, Darth Vader. Kevin, that's such a good choice, dude. I think we could build a really cool Darth Vader. That might be the other character we we'll build. We'll build two more characters today. We built me, and we will build two other characters. So I'm going to let you guys um, decide on which one. So try to pick Venom characters. Or oh, Venom characters. I read somebody said Venom. <laughs> oh, chat. I love you guys. Um, Marvel characters. My goodness. My brain just completely, like could not figure out what I was trying to say. Okay, Spider-Man is going to be one of them. The other one that I'm seeing a lot is Deadpool, and the other one that I'm seeing a lot is Venom. So that's what we're going to vote for. If you want us to build Spider-Man, vote one in the chat, so type in one. If you want us to build uh, Deadpool, then vote two. And then if you want us to build Venom, then vote three. Okay? Now, the last character that we're going to build after, whichever one we pick out of these three, we'll see. It might not be a Marvel character, so we might vary it up. So I'm going to wait for the chat to catch up a little bit just because there's always a bit of a delay. So I'm going to give you guys a chance to, like, spam the chat for a sec just so that I could try to get an accurate reading of what it is that you guys actually want to see um, built. So I'm seeing a decent amount of two and three right now. Not very many ones. So Spider-Man, I think, might be eliminated. So right now I'm seeing more people leaning toward Deadpool and... Uh, Venom. So those are the two options that I see a lot. So that might be uh, one of the two characters that we build. Yeah, I don't really, really, really see almost any ones. Oh, no. Kevin there. He voted one. And there's a couple of other people that voted Joshua and J-Star. So saw them. But then mostly I see like Colton McGregor, uh, PP, uh, IMO, mostly voting for two and three. Okay. Well, 
I'm going to give you guys a chance. Everybody who voted for one, could you please now vote? Oh, Lennon Martinez, thank you so very much for another super chat. And we get another super chat from Solar Flame. And I believe this is the first time super chatter. So thank you so very much for the support. Please do Deadpool, bro. And rip XX, X, ten, ten to... Tentikion, Tentikion. I again, I don't know how to say it correctly. I'm just gonna say rip that. Like, I don't know how to say that name. Whatever, it's fine. I'm just gonna not read that. I apologize. So there you go. All right. So I'm seeing a lot more twos right now. So we're gonna build Deadpool. That's what we're going for. Okay, guys. So Solar Flame, congratulations. I guess we have selected the character that you yourself also wanted to see. So that should be pretty fun. There you go, guys. Done. Deadpool completed. Ta da! Now the most uh, frustrating part of building Deadpool is going to be... I don't know if we're going to be able to do it, actually. Are there any m helmets that would look kind of like a Deadpool helmet? There. Perfect. Um. Okay, guys. Well, we've run into our first issue, and that is that it's going to be unbelievably tough to actually... I mean, that kind of would look good if we could recolor the faces. Why? Why did you not give us the option to recolor heads? I am honestly baffled by that. Because if we could do that, we we honestly could do a decent job. We could create a decent looking Deadpool. But you know what? We could keep the hat as though he's like kind of pulled up the mask and maybe try to do an unmasked Deadpool. What are we thinking, guys? Would that be okay? Would you guys be okay with that? Just because, again, the problem here is that I just... Oh, man. There, you can't recolor faces. So, like, if we could recolor any of these faces, then obviously we could do a decent job. But since we can't, that makes things very, 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 very challenging, of course. I mean, I'm going to scroll through all of them before I start complaining. But there you go. We've scrolled through all of them. And still, there is no option for a face that we could use here. Except for that. Guys, do we do that? Do we do that? <laughs> do you guys want to use that face? An unmasked Deadpool. Kind of like him pulling up the mask. Like, you know how sometimes he'll have the mask up, not all the way? So, like, he'll pull it up either up here or just up to here or whatever. So, kind of like that. Should we use this face, guys? I'm going to wait for a second for chat. If you guys think that's a hilarious face for a Deadpool. Because I think it would be pretty funny, <laughs> pretty funny to have Deadpool like this. So, make Shrek. <laughs> Oh, is, did this face make you think of Shrek? That's rude. That's just rude, bro. Even though that was the whole... Do the most ugly one. Great. <laughs> oh, my goodness. If we use this one, it's, it's honestly going to look really funny. That's amazing. <laughs> I mean, come on, man. You can't be that serious, but I really do think that that's pretty funny. I think that would be a really, really funny look. Yes or no? Okay, so right now in the chat, take a moment to go on ahead and vote yes if you're okay with that face and that hat or, like, mask combo. We'll pretend that he's kind of partially unmasked. Um, and then vote no if you don't like it. So let me know in the chat. I'm going to wait a second because I think it's pretty funny. I think it could look really good. I don't know. It's like him making, like, an animated face, you know, like, where his, like, Pretending that he's in a comic book or something like that. And like he's got his like nose pressed against something or something like that. Because I think it'll be pretty funny. Uh, somebody's like, no face. Okay, hat. Well, thank you. <laughs> At least you were polite. So I do appreciate that. Do the red and white face. Uh, I don't think that would look better, dude. Honestly, the red and white face is going to look quite odd as well, I think. Uh, I assume you mean this one up here. So... Again, it's like half painted like that. I don't think it'll look great. Okay, I'm seeing a lot of yeses. So you know what, guys? We're going to do it. We're going to use this. So hype in the chat. You guys uh, made your voices heard. And uh, it's happening, folks. It's happening. All right. So I know that the hips are going to be easy. And so will the legs. Because I know that there's enough uh, pieces there. Whether it be red and black or red and so on and so forth. So we have lots of options. So we could use these if we want or something that is predominantly red and then has some black on it. Like that, for example, that could be a cool look for Deadpool. Maybe even that one there. Yeah, I think that might be the one to go with, honestly. That that would look pretty decent, not gonna lie. Uh, we could flip it on its head and go black and red or red and black. Is there one where it's red? Yeah, there isn't. 
Because I was hoping one where it was just like this pattern, like this, kind of like a flat color, but only red and black. But I don't think they have that. They have this one here, but the one that I would want to use, they don't have. They have it inverted like this. So we could use that one if we'd like. What are we thinking? What are we thinking here, guys? What are we thinking? Would that would that be a good look? And then, of course, we're going to adjust the torso to be somewhat more Deadpool-esque. And again, the problem is going to be there's not any red torsos to use. Oh, why were there so few red torsos? Guys, weirdest Deadpool ever? Yes, I think so. Maybe this one, honestly, because it's kind of like ninja inspired. What do we think? What do we think? The red legs or what? Somebody's like horrible. <laughs> oh, dude, I love it. I mean, come on, dude. That's the whole point. We're trying to... Well, the point is not to make him look horrible. The point is to go on ahead and collaborate for a look. So that's what we're trying to do, man. We're trying to design a look that is a combination of different components and such. That one would be maybe a decent look. It's an interesting option. Uh, yeah. Not, not, not a big fan of the ones we have there. Hey, Rowan Watts, thank you so very much for the super chat. I believe you're a su uh, first time super chatter. Uh, I've been watching for a long time and I love your videos. Keep up the great work. Thank you. And he hit us with a double thumbs up and the okay sign. So thank you, man. Uh, there aren't any masks. There aren't. I'll show you, dude. I'll show you afterwards. So it seems like a lot of you guys are saying that you want to use the hoodie. So you want to use that? Are we good with that look? Are we good with that look? And obviously, we're going to give him some powers. We're going to need to do that, too. Split the weapons. There are no weapons. That's the other problem. We're not going to be able to... Oh, my goodness. This looks horrible. I'm disappointed. Well, I'm sorry that you feel that way, but we're trying to figure out a torso. And again, you have to remember, there's a lot of limits here. It's not like I'm choosing to be like, hey, you know what I'd really like to do? Make this look horrible. Like, again, something like this, if I could recolor it, great. You know, we could use that. That would have looked cool. I think a torso like this in red would have looked kind of decent as well. There's lots of options that would have looked really, really cool if we had the option to recolor things. We don't. What are you making? <laughs> that's, uh, I love that that's the question. What are you making? That's not a good sign. That is not a good sign. We're trying to make Deadpool, dude. Incredipool. Wait, okay, so you know what? Let's do it this way, just like we did before. I'm going to get you guys to vote. So, number one, if you want this torso, which is the dash torso. Number two, for the kimono, okay? And then number three is going to be the hoodie, okay? So, no, not that one. Which hoodie was it? Is there another hoodie? Or maybe it was that hoodie. I guess maybe it was that hoodie. There we go. I guess that'll be number three. Okay? So you guys vote. I personally think the kimono looks the best. Would be the closest we would try to get to a Deadpool. But it's up to you guys. So I will I will wait. Jamesy, the problem is you're like... You see, the, the issue I have with some of the people who are like... Uh, like this guy here who says, None! You failed! I'm not going to give you a shout out. But it's like... Would you like to suggest how we could make it better instead of just sitting there and being like, this is terrible. It stinks. It's like, okay. Noted. What should we do to make it look better? You know? Would listen. Okay, so it seems like most people are voting for two, which was the kimono. So that's what we're going to go with. Kimono time. There we go. All right, now we need to figure out powers, which is going to be tough because there's no swords or guns or anything that's Deadpool themed. Electric, burrow, dive, psionic, definitely not that. Also definitely not that. Uh, should we make him have teddy bear powers? Animal. I guess this one would make sense because it's got immunity, right? I think that's the... Is that the only one that has immunity? Or regeneration would make sense too, actually, right? Because he regenerates health. Should we go with that then? What are we thinking, guys? Regeneration water? But you can't pick two things. You can only pick one. Oh, Regeneration also has water. But why water? That would make no sense. He's not Aquaman or something, you know? Change the face. Okay. I mean, we voted on the face. We're going to keep it as it is. But that's a fair point. At least, like, you see, I like that that, that person, 
very blue. Thank you so much, because that's constructive criticism. Like you actually went ahead and said something that you didn't like and pointed it out instead of just go like, no, you failed like that other guy, which is just obnoxious. Um, Moopy uh, Fortnite, thank you so very much for the super chat. I believe you're a first time super chatter as well. So I appreciate the support. There's your shout out. Wish you would have asked a question or something, but there you go. Uh, it looks cool to me. Okay. So you guys want to use the water ability? Fly. Why flying? There, There is no flying. Like the, the flying is. Deadpool doesn't fly unless if he's punched really hard and therefore he's flying, but not by his own accord. Who is that person? <laughs> oh, I love it, dude. I love it. I love it. I love it. That's hilarious. It looks awesome. Dude, it is Deadpool. Who said that? Gaming Master. The Green Gaming Master. That's right. It is Deadpool, dude. I love it. Strength. That's what I'm saying, too. We're going to go with the strength. I think that's the one that makes sense because it gives him regeneration and, and some powers and such. So I think that's the one we're going to go with. Okay. Here we go, guys. Let's go on ahead and enter this one. Now... I think, guys, we could do a really good job with Dr. Doom. I think we could honestly create, like, for the people who are being super salty right now, and like, hey, this is not what I wanted, blah, 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 blah. I honestly think we could do a really, really good job uh, with the Dr. Doom design. Would you guys be okay with that if we created Dr. Doom as our third character of the day? I want to see a bunch of hype in the chat. I want to see yes or hype. You can pick and choose. And if you have the emote... Please use that. Kevin, peace out, dude. I will try to make uh, Darth Vader maybe on an upcoming video. So if you guys have that hype emote, hit me with the hype emote. If not, use just a yes or whatever it might be. There's that hype emote. I'll spam a little bit too. So I don't know why I used rage mode, but there you go. So, hey, Moby Fortnite, thank you so very much for the super chat. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, that's it. We're doing it. I think this is going to turn out to be our coolest design. Honestly, I really do. Okay, here we go. Let's do this thing. Dr. Doom. Whew. Okay, now I'm nervous because now it's like the pressure's on, you know? Okay, so ideally there's got to be a hood. Okay. Okay, we have our first problem. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Are you serious right now? Are you like are you kidding me right now? Like really? There is no hood that you can recolor. Why would they not include the hood? The hood is always there. Oh man. Okay, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Maybe we won't use a helmet at all. We'll see. Let's let's look at the faces. So we need a robotic looking face. That's what we need. So let's scroll through all of them and hope that we can find something that would fit that. If not, we might use this with the bucket helmet. That's an interesting look. That is definitely an interesting look. Mm, that, seeing... that might work too, actually. Holy moly. This is tough, guys. This is going to be a toughie. I thought it was going to be super... You know what? Actually, no. We'll, we'll save that for last. First, let's adjust the things we know what to, how to do because they're going to be easy. So, so let's add things that are not simple, but we know which ones we want to use. So do you guys want to see the long cape or the shorter cape? Vote one for long cape, two for shorter cape. I think the longer cape will look a little better. Solar Flame, thank you so very much for the super chat as... Uh, or AS, uh, Stop uh, Motion Productions. Thank you for the super chat as well. Um, stop Motion Productions ask, you could make Two-Face with a red and white face. We could. That's a good suggestion, actually. I think that would look really cool. And then Solar Flame, thank you so very much for the super chat, as I mentioned before. Uh, how do I sponsor on iPad? And hi again. Hello to you. If you want to become a sponsor, go to YouTube Gaming. Or if you're on your iPad, don't use the app. You have to use the actual uh, web browser. So go to youtube.com slash Blitzwinger and then use the link in the description. So uh, just copy paste that and you could go on ahead and utilize that if you'd like or click it. Um, okay, so I guess you guys like the... Wait, one was short cape or long cape? Can somebody remind me? Because I just got confused because everybody seems to be voting for, I think, the shorter cape. Because I see a lot more one than two. 
So was one short or long? Does anybody remember? Because <laughs> I started reading the super chats and I completely got distracted. Short, long, 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 long. Please no cape. Dude, you have to use a cape. I know Edna doesn't like capes, but you have to use... Okay, it was a long cape. Cool. So let's change that back to the long cape. Uh, you have to use the cape because it's Dr. Doom, bro. Gotta use the long cape. Okay. So we're gonna make the hands gray. I think that's great. It looks really weird, that color. Maybe it's because of the blue or purplish background, but I think that that's like dark gray, right? So that'll work. Now, I know that oftentimes his arms are also like gray like that fully, but what I think we could do is there is a really cool pair of arms in here, which is this one. And I think that's the one that we should use because I think it looks really cool. So if you guys are okay with that, I'd rather use that one. I think it would look cooler. Plus it gives them like, kind of like a sleeve look and then it turns into a metallic arm. So I think that that looks really sweet. So let me know if you guys are okay with that. What would you guys prefer? Uh, vote one. I'll remember now. Vote one in the chat if you guys uh, are okay with the... Uh, what are these called? The f No, not farmer. The Everseer hands. Or vote two if you want to just go with the gray hands. So let me know. Or arms, not hands. Ugh, I always mess that up. In the meantime, we're going to pick a torso while you guys are voting on that. Logan Apple, thank you so very much for the super chat. Hey, he, her, I, how are you supposed to read that? H-E-H. -H. That. I was like, he, her. <laughs> man, I'm back. Thanks, man. I appreciate the support. Okay, so we need a green torso. And luckily, dude, there's so many good green torsos in this. It's awesome. There really are a lot of them. But I've said before that I was most likely going to use this one because I think it looks cool. Now I'm realizing that it might be a little too bright of a green, but we could just change the cape and then it'll be fine. Oh, that one looks cool too, though. Oh, man. There's a lot of good options, huh? I honestly did not realize there's so many good ones. Man, we could honestly probably create a couple of variations of, uh, even that one's cool, of uh, Dr. Doom and like do as good of a job with each one of them. So, I, you know what? Let's do the bright green one. We'll do the bright green because I said we would. Um, so I want to make sure that I live up to my word there. All right. So it seems like everybody also voted one. So we're going to use those other arms in just one second. So first of all, we're going to change the cape to be brighter. So nice and bright green like that. So it matches the... Uh, costume, then, oh, we can't, though, because then the arms are going to be the wrong color. Hmm. Well, that, that, that kind of made things complicated. That's why... Okay. You know what? Let's go with the dark green. We're going with the dark green. Sorry. Sorry. I know at this point, like, just pick one. I know. I apologize. I apologize. We're going to go with the dark green look. That one looks kind of cool, too, though. Not going to lie. But I feel like if we do that, we're starting to use too many Everseer parts, and it's going to look a little ridiculous if we use all Everseer parts. So let's go with that. And then for the legs, I think the legs are usually mostly gray. So maybe we could try to find something like that. They're kind of like, he's always had like this weird, it's not a skirt. I don't know. It's not a kilt either. Whatever you would describe that as. Kind of like that, actually. You know? And then, of course, it's about getting the helmet right. I'm going to scroll through all of them just to make sure. Okay, we're going to use the Everseer legs. And I don't know if we want to... Is there any piece that's green and gray? Because that would look cool. I mean, that looks pretty cool, too. Oh, that one right there, because it gives us kind of the metallic rivets on um, robotic type torso. So that's a really nice. Okay. Uh, Logan Apple, thank you so very much for another super chat. You're my favorite YouTuber. Well, thank you, thank you, thank you. Have you tried to put uh, Dash's head uh, on Flash? Um, I did not. I do need to try that. Uh, Jim, Jim Bob Box? Is that how you say that? Jim Bob Box Plays? I'm not, or maybe it's Jim Ob Ox Plays. I have no idea how to properly pronounce your name i'm sorry um all right so now we need to figure out the face oh and that's of course a very very crucial part of this entire ordeal i have no clue 
Guys, by the way, imagine imagine Vegeta. Like, we could straight up do a good job with this. Look at that. That would be a perfect Vegeta. Well, obviously, we change a lot of stuff, but could make a really cool-looking Vegeta using that hair. Okay, let's get rid of the hair, though. Okay, so here's the thing. We're going to need to be kind of creative here and in terms of the decision-making that we do of what we use because, unfortunately, I don't know why they didn't include the typical, like, hood piece that they use for Legos for some or for Lego. Sorry, can't say Legos um, for Lego is not included in here. And that's obviously quite problematic, which stinks. We could do something like that. Obviously, we could change the face as well. Uh, I should have mentioned that, that we were not going to necessarily stick with that face. It's not like a must go with look, you know? So... Or we could obviously also put on like a crazy super extensive helmet, like the bucket, for example. And then there you go. You've got a goofy looking Dr. Doom, you know? What are we thinking, guys? What are we thinking? Should we go with the helmet? Do we go with the helmet? Or maybe this? That kind of looks pretty cool. No? <laughs> lol, lol, lol. <laughs> uh, Captain Madman, dude. You made me laugh, man. You just posted so many lols. And then randomness Ashlyn as well. Change the head. Uh, it, it, I'm going to keep the head something that's gray. So it kind of looks like the helmet of Dr. Doom. You know? Make it green. Green helmet. Wait. So you guys want to try to make the helmet green. That's not a bad call. Guys, I, I sort of think that that could work. Honestly. As ridiculous as it sounds. I really do think that that could work. I mean, that's just not enough of a hoodie, I guess, kind of look. If we could have recolored at least like this up here, honestly, if we could have turned it... Um, green that that might have worked you know so what are you guys thinking shiny stuff that looks awesome okay so we're gonna go with it then guys i like the suggestion this is why i love doing customs live because then we come up with crazy stuff and some of it turns out great some of them looks ridiculous but honestly I think that this is one of the better ones. Like, again, you have to work with what you've got here. There are obviously tons of things that we got wrong or you could say like, hey, why didn't you do this? Or you didn't you do that or this and so on and so forth. It's like, of course, if I could change the colors of everything, then of course I would love to just make it perfect and as precise as I could. But within the customizer, it's not too shabby. I would say that is not too shabby. Somebody's like, I'm reporting all. <laughs> Just to let everyone know. Uh, okay, so I think we should give him electric abilities because I think that's what he's used. Um, ooh, that kind of looks cool, though, with the green. What do you guys think? What ability should we give Dr. Doom? He does not fly, does he? But we could give him a psionic ability as well. What do we think? No, no, no. Don't worry, dude. I was just reading someone's chat about the report thing. It was just funny. He has electricity powers. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm asking, like, maybe electric powers? Because he does look really menacing this way, actually. No? Look at that. Boom. He looks pretty cool. Seriously. Green power. Uh, electric. Okay. So, since there's a lot of people kind of disagreeing, let's do a vote again. So, one is going to be electric. Two is going to be the green power, which is another one of the other ones that people asked. So that's going to be two. And then let's make three the psionic powers, okay? Which is the purple one here, okay? So vote one if you like the electric power set. Vote two if you like the, uh, what is this one called? Earth super. And then vote three if you like the psionic set. So go on ahead and take a quick moment to vote. And then we're going to make a call on our third and final design of the day. Uh, Logan Apple, thank you so very much for the super chat. Uh, hits us with a make Wolverine. That's an interesting challenge. We might do that on an upcoming stream. This is the last character we're creating today, guys, by the way. While I'm giving you guys a little bit of time, it seems like a lot of two and three, or sorry, one and three right now. So I don't really see a lot of twos. So I guess the earth power is eliminated. It's mostly, well, actually, there's a decent amount of threes now. Choose four. What's four? I didn't even make four an option. 
Um, okay, so I, I think we're going to go with... Actually, we might go with three. There's a lot of threes right now, suddenly. Now there's a few ones coming in, but I think there's more three. Okay, I'll give you guys a second. I'm going to give a shout-out to all of our super chatters. Uh, Lenin Martyrs, thank you for the multiple super chats. Uh, Abdul the Boss Vlogs, thank you for the super chats. Solar Flame, thank you. Uh, Rowan of Watts, thank you. Moopy Fortnite, thanks. AS Stop Motion Productions, Solar Flame again. Logan Apple coming through with a multitude of super chats. And then, of course, another super chat from Solar Flame. I appreciate that a ton as well make you next we already did earlier in the stream so make sure you check this video out once it's uh live afterwards okay so i i see a lot of threes so again i'm letting you guys go on ahead and make the votes i would have picked electric honestly i would have went with that but since you guys like the psionic one we'll go with that so there we go all right so we have created the one and only doctor wait i don't even know if he has a period in his name like that maybe not i don't know Dr. Doom. There we go. There we go, ladies and gents. We have created Dr. Doom. Logan Apple, thank you so very much for another super chat. And with that in mind, ladies and gents, that is our third and final character of the day. So let's take a look at all three of the characters that we created really quickly because that's something I didn't do on yesterday's live stream and i apologize about that let me know if you guys would like to see another one of these live streams tomorrow so if that's the case just take a quick moment to go on ahead and hit that thumbs up button that like rating that would be very 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 helpful and thank you to each and every single one of you that has already done so uh can you show us the characters you made today yeah i will in just one second okay so first of all guys do not get uh triggered by deadpool let's start with that one probably the worst one we did <laughs> I can't even take it seriously, honestly. I mean, look, if you look at him like this, like what tell me that that doesn't you, you couldn't believe that that might be Deadpool if he's just like running around like that. Of course he doesn't have katana swords, which is pretty important. But you could kind of believe that it was Deadpool. Maybe we should have put him in the banana suit. Now that I think about it, that would be much more Deadpool-esque, right? Come on. Like, lol, it's not that bad. That's what I'm saying, Savage Wolf. That's what I'm saying. It's honestly not that bad. Like <laughs> Except for when you zoom in. Then it's like, what is that? That's right. Let's let's move on. Okay. So the second one we created was myself, which looks pretty funny. So I'm, I'm still happy. He turned out pretty cool. He's got like a computer tech ability. So he turned out pretty neato. There he is uh, looking fantastic. It's so weird to be talking about yourself in third person, kind of. And then, of course, the third character that we created, the latest of them all, was Dr. Doom. Who, by the way, pretty legit. Come on, you have to see. That's a pretty, pretty legitimately awesome looking Doctor Doom. I have to say, that's probably my favorite. I want to hear your thoughts right now in the chat, guys. Let me know uh, to go on ahead and... Oh, dude, I'm actually really happy that we went with the green helmet. Like, he looks really cool. So, vote for one, two, or three. One Deadpool, two uh, Max or me. And then three was Doctor Doom for your favorite. Uh, Lynn and Martinez, thank you so very much for the super chat. I was going to say that's the last one, but there's just another one that just popped up. Logan Apple, when will you stream again? Tomorrow. So I hope you can tune into that. Thank you, guys. So... <laughs> oh, dude. That made me laugh. Gustavo Rivera. I'm not going to read your comment, but that was hilarious, dude. <laughs> thank you guys so very much for watching. Um, I'm looking forward to hopefully doing another one of these guys, uh, another one of these uh, live streams with you guys tomorrow. That would be a lot of fun. If you guys uh, can start thinking of what characters you would like to see, let me know. Today we created two Marvel characters. Yesterday we created two DC characters. So those people who are like, you're a DC fanboy. There you go. We created Marvel characters as well. So it happens. Uh, Lennon Martinez, thank you so very much for another super chat. Thanks for watching, guys. Like I always say, have an absolutely fantastic day. I will hopefully catch you guys next time. He looks like a mutated potato. <laughs> oh, that got me too. Okay, I got to stop reading the chat. I'm never going to end the stream. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out. See you later, alligators. Bye-bye, everyone.